Hey guys, it's Maggie Lindemann and you're watching Celeb Secrets. Okay, Maggie, welcome to Vegas. Yes, thank you. Uh, this has got to be exciting for you. I mean, it's always exciting. Right? And there's so many different artists here today. I mean, Avril is literally on right now. Yes. It's like one of my biggest inspirations. So. I was going to say, you give me that Avril Lavigne oh, vibe. Thank you. Thank you. That's such a compliment. Yeah. Thank you. Any other artists, though, that you're really like excited to see? Um, Tonight, I'm excited to see Megan Thee Stallion, of course. Um, LL Cool J. Uh, I'll FaceTime my mom. She's like his biggest, <laughs> biggest fan. fan. Uh, so I'll definitely be FaceTiming her. And Halsey. Yeah. 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 And mm -hmm. let's talk about your music. Yes. Because I know you just dropped an album like yes. a couple weeks ago. Mm -hmm. And your debut album. Yes. So how is it now having a body of work out for people to hear? It's crazy. Um, I've been working on it for it feels like seven years because that's how I've been like wanting to drop an album. Yeah. Um, but I've been really, really working on it for the past year. So it feels honestly surreal. Like I don't think it's even kicked in that I dropped an album where everyone can hear. Uh, but it's really cool and the response has been really good yeah. so that's always good is there maybe like one song that you're super proud of oh my god the whole thing yeah I think uh, self-sabotage is probably one I'm really proud of okay um, and hear me out okay. those are my and I know my... like the process is just a lot you know with writing recording putting everything together what did you maybe learn about yourself as an artist or oh a person god. while making this record? so much yeah. uh, I think I've just learned to like be patient with myself and oh just like learned how to be a better artist I think uh, there's so many like trials and tribulations and making an album and like seeing what I did like and seeing what I didn't like and seeing what was absolutely terrible and what was good um, so I think just like the writing process and uh, just like finding who I was through the whole process because like I'm such a different person than I was even a year ago yeah. so to listen to some of the songs I'm like who is that person but I don't know it's a learning process yeah and now what's coming up next for you this year you're gonna maybe go on tour yeah hopefully okay. so I have a couple festivals coming up sorry this thing keeps falling off oh um, I have a couple festivals coming up have aftershock in like two weeks that I'm really excited about a couple festivals next year and then hopefully I'm touring next year okay fine yeah. and maybe like are there any secrets about the album when you were in the recording studio i mean we are celeb secrets so i feel like i have to ask you um, <laughs> secrets i'm like i don't even know um i feel like uh i don't know i'm just really close with everyone i work with okay. um i think we have like a really close bond so we're in the studio like really talking like about everything mm -hmm. so we're in there like not talking but like talking about myself and okay. i'm like talking about like literally myself like I'm like I'm not talking about people like I'm actually talking about myself yeah. and like you'll never believe what I did like let's write a song about it like I'm mm -hmm. so stupid so I don't know I think we do like funny stuff like that and then um I guess the secret like uh um I don't know like I drank a little in the studio I have okay. to sometimes get a little drunk to really tap in so okay. I like to do that sometimes I don't know if that's much of a secret I think like my fans really know that I okay. uh I'd be doing that. So, <laughs> Maggie, thank you so much. It was so nice meeting you. Yeah, it's so to nice you. meeting you too. Thank you for having me. Of course.